seeing how that sound picks up. And if it sounds good, I'll leave it in the video because I don't give a shit. It's really loud though. Holy shit. I gotta turn that down. I just want to be able to play bass like that. That's all. Okay. That's uh, it's by an artist called Run Funk. Oh, interesting. It's it's basically a new genre of electronica called new disco, and okay. it's pretty enjoyable. Yeah. All right. So I'm gonna start some introductions. Oh, and just so you know, uh, before I'm gonna explain this in the video, but I I did some off-camera grinding to make okay. the game go faster. So battles will just kind of sit. We'll just sail through them. Okay. So. Sounds good. All right. Uh, introductions and shit. Not yet, because I need to know what episode number we're on. Uh, twelve or six? Is it twelve? It's twelve. Okay. Okay. So introductions in three. Two, one. Hello, everyone. This is episode uh, 12. 12, yeah. 12. Definitely. This is episode 12. Dinosaur and Megan playing Super wait, Mario it's RPG. It, wait, what? It's 12? It's, is it 12? I think it's 12. It's 12. It's 12. So, do you remember what happened last time? It's been a while. We, uh, we acquired some bombs. And where are we? We're in, uh, in a mine. Yeah. I just got a flower, and basically, when we stopped last time, if you didn't watch the video, which you should totally go back and do, because... Do it, watch them. Because if you do it out of order, it just doesn't make sense. It doesn't. So, we're at the end of the mines, and we're fighting a boss that comes completely out of left field. Um, oh shit, that's not a boss. We'll kill him, it's fine. <laughs> All right. It's okay, we're professionals. Yeah, brief interlude there. Anyways, so we're fighting a boss that comes out of left field. If you look up around that area, you can see our third star piece. We want that. But we gotta kill this crazy looking mofo. Um, he shoved me. That's not acceptable. And here we go. Did I lose you? I think I may have lost you. Me? No. Oh, okay. You're just I'm quiet. I'm still here. I'm just, I'm just trying to catch up and, and check out this, uh, Punchinello. That is his name. And he's being quite polite. Interesting. Now, like, what does he look like to you? Um, some sort of... I thought of Dr. Robotnik at first in his floating egg. But I can't, I mean, it's, it's hard to tell. Giant arms, nice little claws for digging. Kind of like a mole. I am, he's purple. He's purple, well, yeah. That's really all I get out of it. Yeah. He's got a smiley face on his belly. That's true. Is that, like, mocking you or something? I have no idea. But he says we'll make him famous. So... I explained this a little earlier, but I did some off-camera grinding, so we got some new moves. For example, Geno Boost will boost a character, like so. Boosting. And, uh, boosts in this game uh, are like a huge amount, like 50% boost. Oh, really? <laughs> so, yeah, I probably did just about a third of his health there. It, again, it's like that absurd amount of, of damage that you do in this game. It just it doesn't make sense. <laughs> it really doesn't. Oh, he's throwing out tiny little bombs. They're not doing much. So, for uh, the first couple turns, Gino's job is just to boost everyone, really. Nice. You may not get even get to attack if this goes correctly. <laughs> See? You really have this all planned out. Not bad. But let's up the ante. Now he's brought out those bombs. Truly. I'm not Ooh. worried. They're no longer what kind of bullet is. That's how I solved that problem. Oh, what did... What? Oh, what was that? I thought I solved that problem. <laughs> I guess I didn't. Oh, too soon. Well, we'll just speed it up a little. Yeah, there we go. 
I don't know. He just kind of like poked me. It's not that threatening. <laughs> it's like he's tickling you. It's just giant baby grabbing hands. That is a way to describe them for sure. <laughs> it's clobbering time. He is the thing. Is that the guy's name? It's like bomb. So he brought out bigger bombs. Let's see. They're called mezzo bombs. Mezzo bombs. I think that has something to do with music. But I, uh, I should know that, but I don't. And look, we won. Yay! Arg. He's, he's ruined. He didn't want to do this, but now he has no choice. He's pulling out the big guns. And of all people, Mallow is the one shit talking. Seriously. Simmer down, Fluffy. He called him out on it. He did. And look at everyone else. Just calling him out. They're, uh, they're backing him up. Now we're in for it. Or not. Or not. What the hay? Hay is for horses. Oh, oh, oh. that's a knee slapper. It is. Thank you. And <laughs> there we go. What? He crushed himself with his own bomb. Huh. I bet he didn't see that coming. I bet he didn't either. But it doesn't matter since he's dead. Gotta hightail it out of here. They they won't actually say he's dead because it's a kids game, but he's dead. Right. Let's be he's honest. He's gone. He's not coming back. Oh shit. Uh oh. Uh oh. It's gonna blow. <laughs> I like the flashing eyes. Uh oh. And kaboom. Ooh. <laughs> Don't worry, we're fine. <laughs> I like how they're just. Covered in soot. That's that's it. <laughs> you that's think what happened. like there it's there's not even any like burns. No collateral damage. Like everything's fine. Just soot. Yep. The only thing that would make it better is you could see just like the white eyes. Yeah. That'd be a nice little detail. But then again, Mal just has black dots for eyes. So True. like. How would you really convey that? Well, not with Mallow, but Mario, definitely. Oh, look, the star cleaned us off. Aww. And it's going to take a little bit, but I'll just... Spoilers, hey, hey, spoilers. We've got our third star. Oh, spoilers. Third star, we got it's it. Not, not the second or fourth, but the third? The third one. It's a nice bronze color. Ooh. Get it? Third bronze. I don't actually know if they were going for that, but I just ran with it. So, we are three-sevenths of the way there. Nice. Almost halfway there. No, we are, well, you know, in between, sort of. <laughs> there is no halfway. No halfway. There's, like... If we could have four, well, three point five, I guess. Well, I'll I'll try and remember to say when it's three point five. Oh look, we found Dinah, the lost mole child. Ooh. And also, Might is on her back. Dinah and Might. And now, uh, oh, we well. play a mini game. Seriously, I get to just ride a mine car. It's pretty sweet. That's it? Yeah. It's look at this. Wee. Alright, I ride around. I hit the brakes around corners. I collect mushrooms which give me speed boosts. Nice. And that's our mini game. You gotta slow down before tight corners though, otherwise you'll just like fly off the course and lose time. Is there like a like a method to this, or is it all just Eh, there is. I mean, it doesn't really matter how we do now, because it's just kind of getting us out of the dungeon. But uh, if we, later on, it turns into a mini game where you can bet on your times and be like, well, I think I'm going to beat my old time this time, and you get money. Uh. You know, it, it's not a huge deal, but... And look, there's even screen transitions, like, you see how it switched to side view? Now we're yeah. going. Now we're going sideways. Oh, we have a light now. 
And, yeah, you know, again, this game came out at the end of the life of the Super Nintendo, so it, it did some pretty fancy stuff. I still think uh, Donkey Kong did the best mine level. Oh, I, I cannot disagree with that. Hands down. By far. And they always tried to reciprocate it, and I don't know, did you play the, the later Donkey Kongs? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, ah, oh, crap, that's what happens when you don't break, by the way. Oh. Just, just kind of crash, and then magically appear back on the track. Crazy. But, yeah, the, the second Donkey Kong, damn it, they're, uh, they did the roller coaster, which was yeah, like the yeah. mud cart. And then, uh, in the third one, what did they have? They had, like, a snowmobile or something, I think. Or something like that. I gotta I say, though, the third one was hard. One. Damn. Well, I want to do bad. It's fine. I'm doing it on purpose. Uh-huh. Sure you are. I totally am. Uh-huh. And I will admit that, uh... The Donkey Donkey Kong Country 3 is the only Donkey Kong I ever, like, 100% beat. Really? And I never want to do it again. Like, that was ridiculously I, difficult. I, I, I hate love games like that. Like, there are games that I think about replaying, and it's just like, oh, man. I don't want to go through all of that nonsense again. It's true. Like, I, I don't know what compelled me to do it. No, it's just yeah. like, you know, I like the Donkey Kong games. You know what? I'm just going to prove myself. Yeah. I think we're glitching out a little here. You seeing this? Uh -oh, are we floating? <laughs> we kind of are. <laughs> we're like on a hovercraft. Ah, you know, whatever. It's, it's fine. We're at the yeah. end. That's awesome. I wonder how those kids are doing. Sure wish they'd hurry home. I feel like I should be doing a southern accent, but... Just, I mean, come on, settle down, woman. <laughs> Where are we? We're we're back in Moleville to to have uh, a, a non sequitur segue. Get this, I just have this odd feeling this. that they'll be dropping in on us any minute now. And what do you think happens? Uh, we actually crashed to the roof. Oh, they're not going to be happy about that. Gracious, they really did drop in on us. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh, Mario RPG. You, you card. It's so, so funny. I hate puns. <laughs> <sighs> and she does the, uh, the mother does the typical mother thing, make sure the kids are fine. And then, uh, berates the shit out of them. Yep. <laughs> You're good? Fine, now let me yell at you. Yeah, right? Thanks, you know, Mom. Bad or hurt, so now it's, you know, time for punishment. Yep. Well, everyone thanks Mario, because Mario saves everyone. Yay, we saved the day! Of course! Thanks again for bringing our babies back to us. And hooray! We found dynamite and a star piece. But where is Toadstool? Canada. Canada? Yeah. Is that the uh, the logical answer? Definitely. And we are introduced to uh, some antagonists for our next dungeon. Ooh. Come back, Mr. Beetle. Don't you want to come to Boosters and play? No. And then you have Snippet 3, who is clearly the, uh, the stoner of the group. <laughs> uh, like, uh, yeah. what they said, okay? And there they are. Huh. The Snippets. I never knew that was their, um, proper name. And they want the Beetle for Booster, who we don't know who Booster is yet, but... I wonder who Booster is. If I had to use a word to describe him, it would be goon. Goon? Goon, yes. Serica? I mean, he likes beetles. <laughs> so? And also, he's busy keeping the princess from the sky entertained. Ah. That's a little suspicious. Definitely. Uh, pretty please? 
Aw, at least he was nice about it. And now, they run off to catch the beetle. And we're left to do whatever the hell we want in Mobile. Ah. So let's talk to this chick here. Her pretend store. Would I like a shiny stone? Sure. <laughs> she wants she want fireworks. Well, do you think I should give fireworks to a small child? Um, yeah. Well, fireworks cost 500 coins. That's half our money. But we're rich. Who we cares? Rich. And we'll, we'll gain it back. And we I will. want a shiny stone. Would I like a shiny stone? Hell yeah, bitch! Have some explosives. <laughs> and then look how she... Thank you, please come again. Oh, I think I should feel... She not properly yet. <laughs> and we, just... we just gave her fireworks. Yeah, I don't know how we should feel about this decision, but I'm feeling pretty pretty awesome about it. Yeah, I, I think it's okay. Alright. So, now we have... All the way down here... A shiny stone. Its description, a pretty stone. Aww. Keep that in the back of your head. It'll come into play way later on. Okay. But for now, we're going to save after getting our third star piece. And oh, and save. It has to be found out after uh, episode two did not record properly. As you'll notice, I have multiple save files now, and I save in almost every area. It's, it's kind of <laughs> important. Yeah, so this may have been a little short, but you know what? We're starting a new dungeon next time, and it's just... It'll be a long one. <laughs> it might be. I don't know. I'm just... I don't know. We'll say it's going to be a long one. Yeah. Potentially. So, potentially long. I don't have segues. Get used to it. And...